we we'll listen to a little bit music in meantime I'll uh, I'll take the time to show you here because uh, I know I I could skip these uh, steps, but uh, it's important for people to see how much time it must take to enable a mod and something like that. So I will take my time. It's okay. Okay, it's finished. I'll pause the music. So right now I, I have installed Magnum Opus version 0 and okay. I'll install the anti-lag NVIDIA missing lights. It, you can have conflicts, okay. Original map is normal because it's, uh, it's changed some files in Magnum Opus, okay. Shadow improvement, okay. You see, now I have installed all the mods. For example, after that, uh, if you use the Magnum Opus, it is very very important to to use all these mods that I will show you now. Okay, so if you want to use the Magnum Opus uh, in meantime, to the TDV uh, updated some of his mods that he used in Magnum Opus, as and is very important in my opinion to have all these mods. <coughs> so I will go here in the test okay first one is the new uh, the new interface version 6.0 by the dark right okay so I, I will extract this one on the this folder okay and here it is you see here okay so in this one if I go inside I have dials mods text and I have many mods from here you see so if you want to use uh, the real navigation uh, if you want uh, to you to not have symbols you can read the documentation and see what uh, all those mods are doing okay so I before I enable this, this mod and uh, it's uh, uh, available for Magnum Opus. All the mods that I are using the dark uh, the dark in interface before you enable the mod is very important that you make some settings in the out uh, in the option pie uh, to switch uh, your test uh, of the interface because the interface uh, has to, uh, very many choice uh, to switch uh, many many tastes. Okay, so I go here. I go in the new it's uh, C1.0. I go in modes, and here is the standalone mode. The new is 6.40. Okay, is on the third position. I go inside. Okay, I go in data. I go in scripts folder. After that, I go in the menu folder. Okay, and I scroll down here. This is the the uh, folder that I want to edit is the dark right user option pi file okay so I'll open this with notepad and you must read careful all uh, the changes that you can make in your game so for example the first one 
Y if you want to play the game with a, a interface like Silent Hunter 3 style or Silent Hunter 4 style or Silent Hunter 5 and Vincent style. So for example, if I want to play uh, 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 the Silent Hunter 5 with, with this, uh, the interface that I had in Silent Hunter 4, I will go here, I'll choose this copy and you see here UE style, it's now Silent Hunter 5 enhanced. I'll click here and I will just pass this one. So now if I save like this and I install li the mod like this, now I will have the Silent Hunter 4 style. But I will choose to have by default Silent Hunter 5 because I, I like more this style. Okay, so I put this back. So it's better to to read here because you can specify some uh, you, s you can assign some case to, f to do some action in game uh, you can um, uh, choose your dials uh, but uh, most of these uh, uh, settings that you can uh, make from here to be like default when you start the game uh, most most of them uh, you you can uh, doing uh, choose those settings like in-game uh, TDV made uh, some buttons uh, and you can do this uh, in-game uh, not all of them but the most part of them okay so uh <coughs> what I want to to change here for example is uh, I, I will change a lot of more lines uh, it depends of each people taste uh, what is uh, he want to have in his uh, game but <coughs> I, I don't stay now to explain every what is doing everything just read and they are very well explained by the right what is doing okay so for example here uh, are the TDC DR hidden when the uh, uh, era of a uh, beefy it's visible and here if you uh, choose files, uh, files uh, they are not visible if I want to uh, have them visible I click here and I just paste true okay and now they will be visible and so on for each line is very well explained in this option pie okay so what I want uh, I want to change I go here I go find and I go you hall no I go hall okay so here I will change <coughs> the this is the hall uh, number which will be displaying the radio message text is okay so I'll put here uh, my my U-Bot I want to be uh, called by uh, display in the radio uh, box messages like uh, uh, U571 uh, for example just a second okay <coughs> so here I will choose the ship captain name I will put here okay <coughs> and I go here file save and I close this so <coughs> I will explain again is very important before enable the magnum opus if you use or before in each time when you enable a uh, direct interface go in the interface before and uh, uh, change the settings in the option pie okay so I go here again mode here data script menu the last position here is the dar right user option pie okay and go inside make the change save click now <coughs> i can install the uh, this uh, the interface okay so i go here and i go task import mode i go in test okay and i go in uh, new etdc 6.40 I go inside go mods here is the third one you see it now I see data I can you enable this one so I click here okay now I have the mod here <coughs> and uh, I can enable this mod okay next one S conflict it's okay I can do like this. Next one is very important to um, to choose your periscope what you need. Okay, so I I go in the uh, direct in the mode interface. I go in modes, and uh, 
you can see I, I have here new STDC scopes do not enable read. If I enter I have here Arlite, uh, Edmund, Manos and so on. Uh, I prefer for me the Magnus scope. So if I go inside I see I have here Manus scope optional background. This is change only the background but what you need it's uh, the right scope for your resolution. Okay. So how I calculate, how I know what uh, what uh, I need from here, okay? So I, it's very simple. I go in on the screen, click right click on the desktop. I choose here screen resolution, and I see here my resolution in one nine two zero by one eight zero eight zero one zero eight zero. You see, so I do the math: one nine two zero divided by one eight. 1080 this is 1.77 so I keep in my mind 177 okay and I go here <coughs> if I choose this one 16 by 9 so if I do the math 16 divided by 9 it's 177 is the uh, same number so I need this one for my resolution okay it's very important to have 